guys fans are reacting saying that don't pray for this whiskey to come back reactions trade old post of big whiz trolling back or uh, at somebody and that is actually trending on social media right now we're going to be discussing that as one aris baby is now speaking about that old tweet before i proceed for that i still got some interesting things around sofia momodu and davido that is also uh being spoken of on social media and then guys consider subscribing to my youtube channel by clicking the subscribe button below and the bell notification icon to always get notifications each time we upload our videos but if already subscribed thank you for subscribing and make sure you share our videos across social media platforms i love you guys keep supporting free West deep keep sharing my videos keep loving up my videos Yes, in recent time, at an interview, Whiskey came out to say my age and my personal experience made me not to fancy going to parties anymore. That is coming in from Whiskey in recent time. I think uh, Whiskey is a small guy with big experiences in life. You know, St. Clair actually uh, briefing us um, little things that uh, must have happened to Whiskey why under Banky W and a lot of uh, interesting things and what he learned from there I kind of understand this story at an interview Whiskey did say something I said my age and my personal experiences made me not to fancy going uh, to party anymore and that is something I love about this he said I like staying indoors I prefer to stay at home and play with my kid and that is something uh, kind of uh, I have to actually comment about Barogun <laughs> Ibrahim Ayodele and that, that is um, you know whiskey is a peculiar person that is something I kind of understand away from this issue right now uh, I am so sad uh, this is truly a wake up uh, call for me as a father to face breakdown emotionally yes you know legendary singer to face a divya breaks down emotional in reaction to a video of cristiano ronaldo speaking about uh, the importance of family uh, the portuguese footballer in an interview spoke about a difficult situation for him when his father was on a sick bed according to uh, cristiano ronaldo despite being given go ahead by his father it was a tough decision to leave him for a football game and then um, <laughs> that is a person of two face divia is actually saying that man he regrets a lot uh, looking at the lives of cristiano ronaldo with a large influence team man got the family and then respect them a lot he said i have lost so many precious time with all my kids and i can't rewind i'm so sad about that so this is truly a wake-up call for me as a father he wrote um <laughs> on social media and that is well appreciated by a lot of people and then they are saying that man let's learn from a legend like uh, cristiano ronaldo on how to take family matters and love them and show them uh, that man i really care about them um right now i still want to talk about um something that is trending don't pray for this whiskey to come back reactions train old posts of big whiz trolling back to back that is what is trending according to this person said whatever you do please don't pray for the whiskeys to come back the, the, the this whiskey to come back cause Hugo plenty for therapist office that is what is um, you know actually trending on social media yes old post of uh, whiskey actually trolling uh, somebody came out on social media yes let me read it out uh, I will be mindful of my words in reading out this he said I am 25 and have bought two Porsche cars in my life all paid for I also drive a Bentley and I just bought myself a G63 AMG in December but didn't put that of course I don't care about this fame shit. Uh, my mom is about to move to the new house I just bought for her too. 
uh, you have nothing on me linda he's talking to linda Ig. by the time i'm your age i would have turned way better than anyone in your family you still a <laughs> your p still stinks and we don't like you whiskey went ahead to see you almost 40 and sad prayers up for you that is what uh that was what came from whiskey at the point you know had problems with linda ikeji but whiskey did focus something he said i'm 25 and by the time i'll be 40 <laughs> man, i'm gonna be greater than everybody in linda ikeji's family and whiskey right now before 40 whiskey is not up to 40 man it's already done that and that is actually huge getting a grammy award is one big thing uh selling out o2 arena 30 times in less than you know an hour is actually a big thing for whiskey let me say essence performance is actually bigger than the career of linda ikeji that is something i kind of understand i think uh, that came from you know come from from kind of true drive inspiration you know and whiskey was able to focus it better and a lot of people came out to say man linda ikeji you know what you've been the step on our tools and the rest and uh, i think uh, linda ikeji better watch it at a point in time like this and people are now saying that man whiskey maybe not pray make the old whiskey come back because it you not know, go better it not go too cool at all that is what uh some persons are now saying and what do you believe about the old whiskey man this guy has got some strong languages and that can actually put somebody in trouble um <laughs> now long time no one bear that is coming in from sophia momodu davido's first baby mama sophia who says as she shares a new photo of her on instagram that is actually huge loving herself up and it's a big one and this time around people are quick to like interpret anything she says right now to uh davido and choma and a lot of things happening around and what is your own take about the story i believe that she is actually speaking for herself but when you check the comment section some people are quick to say a lot of things i think we need not throw people like that wish you a kind of be mindful of uh, people's mental health support them through uh, difficult times and other things especially when they are showing self-love to themselves and uh, that is one thing i really want to like you know kind of beg a lot of people to do and also support women um in some times of difficulty because if you don't do that i think we are doing more harm to the society away from that let's talk about uh, you know what reno actually raised in recent time reno said a woman who loves to hear sweet um sweet nothings will end up with a man that has nothing tangible for her life is not only sweet ask hard questions before accepting his proposal uh what is your salary how many children do you want with your relatives live with us that is one of the hardest questions to ask and a bank um reno is actually saying that and uh, we kind of understand that from a different point of view and uh, what is your own take about this story so far i need that in the comment section so that we can actually expand it together before i jump up finally i want to take out this time to really appreciate you guys for watching my videos and sharing them across social media platform if you are new here why don't you take out time click the subscribe button below the bell notification icon to always get notifications each time we upload our videos you can go and check us out on other social media platforms facebook uh, twitter instagram and then be a part of our daily conversations i love you guys